everybody, Renee here. It's gonna do um, a simple 10 minute um, standing yoga flow. So we're not gonna go down to the mat. So if you have wrist or knee issues, we're just gonna keep things standing up. So let's have our feet about hip width apart, just a nice, easy, comfortable stance. We're gonna bring our hands to our heart, close your eyes or soften your gaze, and just take a few grounding breaths. Feeling the connection of your feet to your mat. You can lift and spread the toes. Feel like you're rooting down through the heels as you lift up through the legs, through your center, growing taller through the crown. Let's inhale just to reach up, no back bend yet. Just come into a nice tall line here, feeling your posture. Try not to arch the low back yet. Feel that rib cage dropped as the arms reach up. From here, we're gonna fold into the hinge of those hip creases, floating all of the way down. And just soften the knees on this first one. Let the head dangle free. Breathe into your back. Here we're going to reach the arms back. You can keep the knees soft. Just feel that nice flat line here through your back. Often we stay a little hunched here. So try to hug those blades back. Again, knees are soft to make this more accessible. And then imagine your heart lifting you up. Keep pressing down through the legs. Feel that connection through the glutes. So reach your tailbone long now as you lift your heart up. And then return center, return hands to heart. Take a centering breath. Staying neutral again, let's inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Softening the knees, softening the spine. Take three breaths in and out. Let the head hang loose. Feel your breath expanding the back. We're gonna float the arms back as you inhale, lengthen to a flat back or straight line. And then keep reaching through the fingertips, root down through your heels as you lift your heart up, tailbone down, and return center. Inhale, reaching up. This time, reach the tailbone down, gentle back bend. Go to where it feels good in your body, and then exhale, fold, maybe keeping the legs a little straighter this time. Inhale, floating halfway up. Exhale, let's fold back down this time. We're gonna bend the knees and then roll up like a rag doll, stacking one segment at a time. We're gonna inhale, sweep right up into that lift, gentle back bend. Exhale, folding forward and down. Let the head release. Inhale, lengthen to that flat back straight line. Exhale, fold, release. Soften the knees and just rolling up. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lift, lengthen, pull those blades back. Exhale, fold, soften, and just roll it up. So roll those shoulders back. Take the right foot back, just into a tiny lunge, so nothing too drastic. Back foot is slightly turned out, and hips are gonna try to stay square here. So again, it's not a huge lunge just yet. Feel grounded, feel rooted, front knee bent, back leg straight. I want you to clasp the hands behind the back, and then roll the shoulders open. As you reach down through the floor, you're gonna reach your heart up. Feel a little energy in the glutes, lengthening the tailbone, pressing the hips forward. And then release the arms, circle them straight up. We're gonna straighten our front leg here and then fold forward. Go to where you can, hands can be on the shin, blocks, 
Go to the floor, let the head release. Take a nice big breath in and out. I want you to soften both knees and try to roll up again in this tiny stance. Sweep the arms up, come back to parallel feet. Lengthen the tail, lift the heart. Exhale, let's fold forward. Soften the knees again, just take that nice slow rolling up and we're just gonna reverse that. So left leg back, small lunge here. Slight turn out in the back foot, front leg parallel, knees bent. We're gonna clasp the hands behind the back. As you reach energy down, roll the shoulders back, lift the heart up, gently press the tailbone into your pelvis. Feel that opposition, lift and lengthen. Gonna release the arms, center the gaze back forward, straighten that front leg. Lengthen out over the front hip, lifting up through that kneecap. Again, you can use blocks here, hands to the shin, wherever you feel comfortable. Let that head release completely and breathe into your legs. From here, we're gonna soften the knees and just try to roll it up again. Sweep both arms up, come back to parallel legs, lift the heart, lengthen the tailbone. Exhale, sweep, fold. Inhale, lengthen part way up, bring those arms back, hug the blades together. Exhale, fold, soften the knees. And again, just slowly rolling it up. We're going to clasp the hands, push palms forward as you round the back, soften the knees here so you can tuck the tailbone as well. And then we're going to flip the palms, pull the elbows back as you create that nice arch or back bend again. We're going to repeat that. So soften into a scoop, soft knees, push forward, open up through the blades. And then softening the elbows, lift the heart, pull the shoulder blades back, lift. One more time, push forward, scoop, and pull back, lift, lift, lift to where it feels good. Let's bring the hands to heart, pause, center, take a breath, ground through your legs. We're gonna go into one more lunge here. I'm gonna take it into a little bit of a bigger lunge. So if you need something for balance now, a chair, a wall, um, please do so so you're safe. So we're gonna take our right foot back. We're gonna stay up on our back toes. This is a high lunge, it's a longer stance. Now be mindful of how the low back is feeling here. So we don't wanna necessarily jam or over tuck the tailbone, but just do what feels good for your body. So the cue that you need to feel safe and lengthen through your back. So rooting down through the legs, we're gonna sweep the arms up. First, just come to this neutral place that we first worked in that very first movement. Arms are up, but I'm just in a neutral spine. Now from here, as you lengthen the tailbone down, pivot the heart up so that both ends of the spine are moving together. Come back up, lift. Let's reach forward and just push off that back leg back to our two feet. Hands to heart, take a centering breath, regroup. Taking our opposite leg back, again, using the wall, the chair, if you need to for balance. We're staying up on the toes, once again in our high lunge. Lengthen the tail, lift up through the arms, but just keep the spine straight to start. Find your balance, feel grounded. Now, as you lengthen the tailbone down, we lift and pivot up through the heart. Think of lifting up as much as you go back. Feel that opposition, take a breath. Float the arms forward, push back up to two feet, return your hands to your heart. Inhale, reach up, take yourself into that nice back bend again. Exhale, fold forward. 
Coming all the way down, let your head release, soften the knees. Feel like you're gonna hang loose. Little ragdoll motion here, let everything relax. And then slow motion, rolling yourself up. Feel the heels root down, the glutes reach the tailbone long. Just lift up through the chest one last time. Return your hands to heart. Take a few closing breaths for yourself, or this is a great time to move yourself into a meditation. Thank you very much.